What up, family? It's your boy SN TV, man. Um, before I get started, I would like to ask y'all, man, to go ahead and hit that like button. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. We at 251,000, trying to go to 300. After that, 500,000. Then after that, a million, man. I'm trying to go and get that gold plaque out the way and rebuild the channel. The subject of Can't Get Right, if you don't know who Can't Get Right is, um, STL, man, man, you know, uh, EBT, man, man, Taekwondo world. Some people say he was close to the Taekwondo world. Um, but we all know that he was real close with Duck. He was real close with TB, Poppy, uh, Brick, and all of those guys. The subject has repeatedly come up about who unalived him. Now, you got a lot of people on one side saying that it was Duke and Muwap. And the reason why I'm saying their names is because there's no evidence showing who did that for real, for real, if we just being honest. But then you got another side saying that 051 Melly actually backdoored Can't Get Right. And this is why um, 007 Nate hit Melly. Now, on one end, it's the fans going off, two guys running up with mask on, doing something that can't get right because it was all recorded. It was a video out. These people are going on body structure and the way somebody run versus the other side, family and friends saying that the whole time, 051 Melly was the one that did that to can't get right. Now, some people might say if 051 Melly did that to can't get right, then it was a backdoor situation. But when you really think about it, was it really a backdoor situation? Because for a long time, Taekwon World and 051 have been at odds. Okay, so since Melly and Duck was cool, people looking at it like, well, why would Duck have been hanging with 051 Melly if he knew that he did that to can't, can't get right? Well, a lot of reasons. First of all, I don't think that 051 Melly and Duck was just that cool. Like I don't think that they was that cool. I think that they was cordial. You know what I'm saying? I think that 051 Melly, you know, respected Duck, and I feel like Duck respected 051 Melly. But we got to remember, Melly is rumored to be the one Duck's cousin, blood cousin. Raheem from THF, right? This wasn't just no internet rumor. This was a real street rumor. So if Duck heard that and actually really seen it, Melly kind of confessed to it. So if that was the case then and he was still kicking it with Melly, wouldn't you think that somebody that wasn't even his blood cousin, I mean, I'm pretty sure that his blood cousin meant more to him than can't get right, even though can't get him and can't get right was close. You know what I'm saying? But then you got to look at this too. Duck probably didn't know for sure. Duck probably didn't know for sure. You know what I'm saying? But Duck knew something because before Melly went to that party, Duck told Melly not to go to that party. And this makes a lot more sense because I can't see Nate just catching this man like that at a party. Um, because Melly's supposed to have been shot his house up or something like that. And I can't even see Melly being brazen enough to even be at no party. It really like a get together for can't get right. Knowing he did that to can't get right. That's hard to believe. I mean, they say Melly was a, was a, he was a real grave digger. He was a real hitter, man. He wasn't scared of nothing. But I mean, that was damn near suicide if he did that. I think that. Melly probably thought that really didn't nobody know who did that. I mean, it, that was masked up. You know what I'm saying? Who would have knew? We do see in the video that Melly and Can't Get Right had some type of friction between each other. Why on Poppy Day was Can't Get Right dropping wise, man? When they were celebrating for Poppy, why was he dropping wise in front of Melly? He looking at Melly dropping wise. And then they, they they turn the camera. You see Melly looking at him like with a 
you know, with a look on his face like he feeling some type of way. He looked dead that can't get right there and look at Duck. You know what I'm saying? You got EBTBG saying that Melly did it. Always talking about T.Y. can't get right. And a lot more of the guys. Tell him who really knocked them down. Y'all around the niggas every day that really knock folks down. And this y'all homie. Y'all know, I know. And clown, only thing you said that was true, folks, that Parkway didn't do that. Only guys, they ain't do that to can't get right. Folks, that's the only thing that was accurate for. They came out your the one of the niggas that did that ain't here to talk about it. You got can't get right sister even saying that Melly did it. And now people are coming out saying, you know, hey, man, 007, they out. Don't put him in nothing. Rest in peace, get right. So it all comes, it, it all boils down to this. Am I going to take the word of people who wasn't there? People who not from there, people who probably never been there, people who just really getting their information from the internet versus people who live with these people, came up with these people, they know how these people was, they 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 they, they kicked it with these people on an everyday basis. They know what's really being said on the streets of Chicago versus it coming through a second, third, fourth, and fifth party. You see what I'm saying? I think I'm going to believe them. And it is hard to believe. And some of us might not want to believe it, man. But at this point, man, I think that Melly probably did do that. Melly probably did do that. And then they saying that Melly has something to do with Cy and Motor being back, though. Then they saying that Melly has something to do with um, Ambry being, you know, took out. So, hey, man, you know, at the end of the day, we can't dispute that 05 won the Taekwondo world, man. A lot of them gyro sitting, a lot of that shit, you know, they wasn't cool like that. The only reason, the only bond that tied them together was Melly. And Melly might have just been back on some of them guys, man. I mean, the truth hurts sometimes. But it is what it is. It's your boy SNTV. I'm out.